Right, I'll treat it like um, a normal lesson. Um, I have been watching, the thing that's been worrying me the most about the test is the three minute briefing. But I watched your video of, um, I can't remember who you're, who you're with. Alex. Yes. I watched him and then I watched you do your demo of the three minutes. I, I can see it's quite tricky. Yeah, my demo of the three minutes is boring. <laughs> <laughs> so that's the thing kind of... It's hard, isn't it? Yeah. I was about to go, then I said about the extra passenger, I think. Was that the one, one and I thought, do you know what? I yeah. just like left that, so that took another minute. So, so one thing I'd like to ask for is after... Because I'm going to pick you up about half seven, and I'll test on yeah. half eight. Okay. So uh, we're going to have a little bit of lesson. And we talked about having a lesson as a two-hour lesson, like like a normal lesson, but the first hour is just us. And then halfway, we're just picking up the examiner, and then we're carrying on. That's the way I'm, I'm trying to think about it. Yeah. So after an hour of doing, well, if we do this, or a certain amount of time, we stop, and then act like we just picked you up. So I just want to practice the recap side of it. Yeah, so if you, if, let's, I don't know, let's say there was a problem of, I don't know, missing gaps on roundabouts, mm. couldn't judge a gap, then do that ex explanation of how to do it mm. before the examiner gets in the car. So then once the examiner's in, you're just sort of letting the examiner know what's just happened mm. and what you're doing now. So... You know, you could say, well, I've done a little briefing and we've explained how to get gaps and blah, blah, blah. And just recap with Joseph, so how, you know, do you know about blockers or what, whatever it is you just told him about, just so Michael knows what you just sort of covered, a sort of very quick Q&A. And then it'll be right, so that, should we just have a go and, go and do it? And then agree levels of responsibilities, for example. And, yeah, as, a, as an example, that was. Yeah. So what do we have to yeah. deal with on the way there? What kind of obstacles? No roundabouts. Good. Definitely. And how do you find about how do you find the roundabouts? Well, they're okay. Yeah. If you gave yourself a score out of ten, what would you give yourself? Seven. Yeah. yeah. Something seven. What What would you do to make it an eight or nine? What What do you need to improve on it? Where's your weak no, points? You think? Perfect integration with like other people and. Uh, yeah. Actually, paying more attention to other people. Good. So dealing with other traffic, yeah. judgment of when to enter roundabout. Cool. Yeah. Is there anything else? The mirrors is. Good. Mirrors was a good, a big thing yesterday, yeah. wasn't it? It's kind of hit or miss with us. Yeah. I've now, tried to all of them, or none of them. <laughs> <laughs> Do you feel confident of knowing what mirrors you need to use? Yeah. I've, yeah. I know what mirrors to look at is just looking at them. Um, what risks are there of not checking the mirrors, though? Cyclists, other cars, all um, sorts. What, what's the risk of that? If you didn't check your mirrors, what could possibly happen? You could have someone overtaking you without you knowing. Good. Well, there's lots of scenarios, but it could yeah. be dangerous, can it? Yeah. Okay. Um, should we make that one of our goals for today, then? Yeah. Focus on the mirrors. Um, so, today, what would you like to do? Yeah. yeah, work on roundabouts, not a problem. Um, so let's break it down into sections then. So we talked about mirrors. We want to work on that today. How much help do you want with the mirrors? Do you feel confident enough to do it on your own? You just want to practice or me keep an eye on you? Keep an eye on me and scream in fear if I don't do it. <laughs> okay, so let's, let's break down the other sections as well. Because we have, we've spent some time on roundabouts, but yeah. quite basic roundabouts. So we'll probably start off with these roundabouts around here, mm. and then progress from there. Okay, but mm -hmm. so what's after what's after mirrors? What's our routine? Okay, so it's always mirrors. Good. Indicator. And how do you feel about the indicator? After position, what have we got? That's a good question. Uh, position indicator. Speed so scared. Good, good, good. And how do you feel about that? I'm okay. It's I'm not the best at changing down gears. That's. I'm okay at changing up. Just. Changing down <laughs> is, what do you find simple. difficult with it? Is it the actual motion of um, changing the gears, or? I don't know. Is it just because you're approaching the roundabout and yeah. there's a lot to do? I, I feel like I tend to go into roundabouts quite fast. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. So it's speed. There's nothing we can work on today. Yeah. Uh, how much help would you like with that? Would you like me to talk you through the speed to begin with? Yeah. Start with, and if I seem to do okay, then yeah, 
Okay. And then, what's last? Uh, just look around. Good. And you, are you happy with where to look? I know whereabouts. To, it's your exit and to the right. Yeah, where else could you look? There's two good places you could look. Your exit. Mm -hmm. and right. Uh, behind you. Uh, behind you, isn't, uh, I don't know. So on approach to the roundabout, you've already checked your mirrors. You've seen what's going on yeah. behind you. You've checked your mirrors. So you've said two good options. Check to your exit to make sure it's mm. clear. Check to the right. Why do we check to the right? Because that's where things are coming from. And who has priority? Then. Good. What could help us enter the roundabout? What other direction? Knowing what's mm. going on in that direction, could you figure out a way to get into that roundabout sooner? What could stop the cars to your right? What could stop them in place? A car that's also coming. From what direction would it come from? Like opposite you or... Yeah, they're, yeah. they're straight on. Good. Yeah. And that's a thing we can work on. Yeah. And that's a good way to help you get into those gaps. If you know those cars coming from your right are going to stop, yeah. they're stopping for a reason. Yeah. Okay? And if we can use those cars coming around yeah. from straight on, called blockers, yeah. to help us get into that roundabout. Okay? Now that's the thing we've we've struggled with most is judgment, and I've I've been helping yeah. you on the roundabouts we've done with that, haven't I? Yeah. Do, you, do you want me to keep helping you with that? Yeah. Should we kind of focus on because I don't want to build up your plane yeah. too much? <laughs> Should we try to focus on the mirrors and the speed today? Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. So you're responsible for the mirrors indicator and position. And I'll help you with the speed and gear and judgment of looking and knowing when to go. Yep. Is that okay? Yep. Cool. If you've got any questions on the way, don't hesitate to ask, okay? Yep. I'm here to help. If I do feel like you're struggling, I can always just talk you through it, okay? Yep. And in worst case, what else can I do? Yeah, those things. Those things, yeah. yeah. What else can I do? Grab this. Okay. But it's only for worst case scenario, yeah. okay? And if we do have to do that, then we'll stop and talk about it. Yep. Okay? So... Before we move away from this bit, what's a good thing to do? Check the mirrors. Good. First roundabout, we go left first exit, please. Okay. This junction, that's good, good spot. Speed wise, we're all in a good gear. Yeah. We just take time with it. Okay, look at that. That's it. Nice low speed, get good vision. Is anyone there? So, focus on position as well, don't lose track of it. Slow down there, come to a stop. First, get yourself ready, it's fine. He's going off, so off the brake. Take your time, take your time. Clutch back down. Take your time. Nice and slow, right back. There we go. A little bit of gas, a little bit faster now. We've got the speed, we're going to doddle on the roundabout, okay? Don't worry, we'll talk about it. What's the speed on this road? Focus on the speed now. It's a bit faster. Got another round back coming up soon. We're going to go left first next, okay? Good mirrors. So we can focus on the speed. Good. Ease off a little bit. Don't lose too much speed on the coach. Good gear change. Just roll towards the mountain. Got enough time to look. Is anyone there? No. Keep track of what you're doing as well. Just follow it around. Good to go. So, big more to the left. That's it. Come off. That's okay. That's all good. And can we just turn left into this car like this very quickly? You're fine, don't worry. You got it. That's it. Good. I don't know if we're 
So he secured the car. Okay, let's have a little breather. Okay. <laughs> now, yeah. we haven't had someone in the back before, have we? No. How do you feel uh, at the moment? Kind of got over there, but. Yeah? Yeah. Not adding any pressure? Yeah, possibly. If, try and relax. I know it's yeah. hard because yeah. it feels like it, but Howard's honestly not there to judge you at all. Okay, he's just literally here for me. Um, let's talk about the roundabouts before we do set off again quickly, okay? So on approach to that first roundabout, why why did I step in? Because I actually had to use the brake a little bit to stop us. I was going too fast then. Yeah, what was, what was to our right? Oh, there was a car suddenly coming around. Good. Yeah. Would you have stopped? No. Sure. So, that's fine, yeah. that's fine. I should have helped him probably a bit more with that, with the car coming around. Yeah. But as soon as you see that car, yeah. just yeah. come to a stop, okay? Okay. Moving away from that roundabout, yeah. what happened? I stalled a bunch. What, what, what did you once? What was the, yeah. what was the cause what? of it though? Why did we stall? Was we in second? He wasn't actually, he was in the right gear. What or happened with just, the clutch? Just bringing the clutch up too far. That's it, that's all it was. It's a bit too rushed, okay? Always remember, because we had this trouble quite a long time ago, but we kind of overcome it, didn't we? Yeah. We got very good at clutch. When you're ready, let's get going. That's it. Always follow that rule. Good. Least dangerous, most dangerous. Good. I highly doubt that the clutch, and I should have indicated. Here. So, you asked about the indicator. Yeah. In that scenario, there was that car there. Yeah. So, indicator here. Yeah. <laughs> so, in that scenario, with that car being there, it's very likely it's going to start reversing back. But there wasn't anyone really there to benefit from the signal. That's what you need to ask yourself. Yeah. But if you are in doubt with the signal, just do it. That's it. Better to need it and not, yeah. not have it. As long as you're not misleading anyone. distance should we keep from the car in front? You said it's a good distance? Yes, yeah, I agree. It's good. Do you know what the rule is? What we kind of rule we use for this with judgment? One car. A rule called tyres and tarmac. Yeah. As long as you see their tyres and a bit of the road, you've got enough space from that car in front. Okay? Road, you've got enough space from that car in front. Okay? First steps again, remember to think about your timing of the signal to cancel it. That's it, good. Speed's good, gear's good. What we're going to try and do is slowly approach it. Be ready to stop just in case. Brakes in position as well. He's got a left signal on, so a bit of gas, you're good to go. That's it, a bit more gas though, a bit more gas. That's it. So that was quite a good gap, a bit more speed though. Brakes are not speed. That's it, a bit more gas, a bit more. A bit more. So with that white van being there, he was entering the roundabout. Because we had a decent speed and gear, yeah. we need a bit more welly, but there was enough time for us to enter that roundabout. Does that make sense? Okay, so with smaller gaps, but, so approaching that roundabout, left first exit, remember folks on the speed a bit slower. That's it. Get the gear changed on nice and early. Anyone there? Focus on position at the same time, alternate. That's it, good to go. So, approaching up roundabout, left first exit, remember to focus on the speed a bit slower. That's it. Get the gear changed on nice and early. Anyone there? Focus on position at the same time, alternate. That's it, good to go. And focus on the signal to bit We've got another roundabout coming up quite shortly. 
again, we're going to go left first exits. Catch that signal now. I think there was some for it. So, a bit slower. Touch back up. So, anyone there? No? So let's get going. It's all about those quick decisions as well. If you see nothing there, take advantage of it and go for it, okay? Good. The last little bit of braking, try not to be so heavy, okay? Yeah. You start off really nice and aggressive, just yeah. gently at the end still as well, okay? Mitch, can I say one thing to you? Yeah. When we move up on here, just really watch. Okay. So just before we move away, what should we start doing? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, so, sorry, sorry, yeah. carry on, carry on, you're good. Can you see it? You can check the mirrors. Ooh. You had this trouble before where you were looking with your eyes as well, but yeah. you're not making it obvious. And if I can't yeah. see it, yeah. I don't think you've done it. But yeah, really focus on those mirrors, okay? Yeah. That's one of our goals for today. Yeah. So, again, we're going to go left first next to him. Good mirrors, good signal. Well done with the speed. A little bit more braking just to slow you down. You want a bit more time to see what's going on, okay? Now it's clear, look where you're going. Good to go, bit of gas, bit of welly, and we're good to go. Nice that. Take advantage of that gap because it can soon change, okay? So as soon as you know it's safe, have that decision, go for it. We talked about larder, didn't we? Look, assess, decide now. And it's, it's important, once you've made that decision of going, that you act on it. If you feel like you're not slowing down enough, yeah. add a little more fresher. Before you move away, good, well done. Much better. So next roundabout, you can go left first, actually consider the signal, the timing of it. Good speed at the moment. Focus on your position as well. Don't lose track of your position. Is it clear? Yeah. Position again. That's it. Good to go. Nicely done. Bit more gas. That's it. You're, when you enter that roundabout, you want to try and get away from it. So 